Here's Bill Bill. <laughs> yeah, the, there's the one. Yeah, she gave us a quite a quite a scare the other day. You can see how tiny she is. You can see her arms. She still has her IV in. Uh, we're at Doctor Music's in uh, Madison right now. They're uh, taking good care of her. Mm -hmm. She gave us a scare. I thought for sure we was gonna lose her. Even the emergency vet, you know, they wasn't hundred percent sure whenever we first got her there. Thankfully, she responded in like five minutes once uh, they got her some glucose. Where are you going? She's, she's, uh, we're just, I'm trying to get her to eat. You know, I got some different food options. Hopefully that's what she's trying to do. You trying to get some food? You trying to get some food, baby? You wanna be a star? Hey, there's my grumpy baby. My grumpy baby. Yeah. So her being diabetic, uh, her body's responding pretty strong to insulin. So uh, we're, we're still trying to figure out the whole insulin thing. The problem right now we're having is getting her to eat. Um, we like for her to get the Libre. Uh, it's a little device to stick on her skin. And that would allow us to, uh, instead of having to use a Lancer, you know, Lancet and a glucose meter, we can just, uh, you know, electronically get her glucose uh, numbers. But sadly, whenever the cats are real, you know, tiny like this, uh, they're not very accurate is what the, you know, what the emergency vet and drug music was telling us. So uh, she's at seven and a half pounds right now. She's very, very tiny. Uh, we need her to be at least nine to get the, uh, the Libre. So I'm, uh, I don't know if they was ever successful getting her to eat yesterday. I know when I called, I called multiple a lot of times. So uh, when I last called at five, I still ain't got gotten her to eat uh, past a few licks. So uh, I came today right after work, rushed here as fast as I could. Uh, they just opened the doors. And I, I'm here. <laughs> uh, well, they opened doors to the public, and they're here for that. Uh, I, I didn't bring my tripod or anything. I didn't. My thought was just to get here. Uh, I brought some different food for her to try. Oh no! Now her breath don't smell so bad either. Uh, she's doing so much better. Uh, even whenever she was home with us, she wasn't doing this good. Uh, the mercy vet is what really helped uh, and got her you know, this good. And, you know, Doctor Music has ma maintained her at this level. Um, the mercy vet was able to get her to eat. So, you know, I'm hoping she ate some yesterday. Uh, like I said, that's what we really need to get her to do is eat. Uh, diabetic food or regular food, any food, it doesn't matter. Just food. Uh, we need her to gain weight. But uh, I want to give everybody an update, you know, on the pretty baby. Sadly, I won't be taking her home. Uh, I'm at, after what happened, I... I uh, especially where I'm working right now, and I can't be with her 24-7, I want somebody with her 24-7. If we wasn't home when she crashed, we would have came home to her and passed away. And, and that was so scary, just getting her to the emergency bed. It was, uh, it's still emotional, if you can't tell. Uh, I'm just so tickled to death. She's doing good. But, you know, uh, Yeah. Uh, if anybody has any, you know, suggestions, any help, uh, or just some kind words about how she's doing, uh, you know, feel free to comment them below. Um, we've had some people ask about her, uh, you know, since we've been commenting. You can if you refer back to some of my older videos, and you can see her uh, in her in her you know more normal weight. Please tell me you're gonna eat. You gonna eat? No. Well, you know, she's in a non-familiar space. Oh, please, please eat, please, please eat, baby. She's thinking about it. I'm, uh, I'm gonna spend some time with her. Hopefully, if I get her relaxed, she'll eat. Um, just I I anything if she'll eat. Uh, I got some wet food. I brought. Um, I got you know. 
all kinds of food. I got, you know, brought this food. And got, uh, you know, so I forgot her, uh, her new diabetic food. Uh, the treats she likes. Taste, uh, her normal, uh, hard food. The, uh, the older cat, cat food. And then just a bunch of different types. Uh, of course, we got the, uh, the biome. Uh, this is what the emergency vet got her to eat. And then we got stuff that, you know, she's normally eating. She's wanting, she's wanting out. She wants to go home. But sadly, uh, she won't be going back home with us until Thursday. Because, uh, you know, I'm not off work till then. And we, somebody can't be with her 24-7 to make sure she's okay. So, you know, we're, uh... It sucks not having her home, but I want her in professional hands. I, I, I want to make sure somebody's here. I want to make sure she's being looked after. I don't care what the cost is. Uh, not, I'll sell everything I have just if she could be good. She's mad. She could be needing to use the bathroom for all I know. But... Like I said, I'm going to spend some more time with her, uh, getting out of her food. Uh, I'm going to, I need to see if they gave her her, uh, hunger medicine yet. Uh, appetite increaser. So if not, then I'm going to give that to her. And, yeah, uh, I got some different foods for her to try. And, yeah, uh, wish us luck. And, yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully you can get her back to being the, the regular bell bell but yeah uh no code word is this an update video and i'll see y'all later peace